Okay, there we go. Would you rather eat a quarter or eat chapstick? Eat a quarter or eat chapstick? Eat chapstick. You can actually digest. I mean, not on digest. You can you can get chapstick is. Do you think the tube? Uh, yeah. Are let's you sure? No, no. You let's assume, the... yeah. You, let's assume you have to hork down the whole thing. Oh, then God, no. No quarter? Yeah. No, oh, but chapstick for sure if it's just the the innards. I don't think you have to eat the tube. Everyone's chapstick. saying chapstick. Yeah. I'd go with quarter. You can chew chapstick. I don't need to chew it. You can, like, uh, it'll, like, it won't. I wouldn't want to chew it. Chew quarter it. is this big, pop it down. Like chapstick, a pill. you just mush it up and you put it in jello. I'll eat a quarter right now. Don't eat a quarter. I'm do you, eat do a you have quarter. change lying around? Who has change in 2018? Okay, this SD card's about the same size as a quarter. Eek. There's probably nothing important on this SD card. <laughs> you Will think eat? that SD card would survive? No. Going through your body? No, definitely not. No? You think you could get that down? Don't do it. I'm I, just curious. I could easily get this down. I use, I, I, as a kid, <laughs> as a kid, I would test myself to see how What's many. Wrong? How many, how many ravioli I could eat whole at a time, swallow whole at a time. <laughs> I started with the mini raviolis. I got up to three, three mini raviolis. The big raviolis are harder because they're wider, but I stack them. I'd look for those that are stuck together and I would eat them. I really want raviolis now. I haven't had raviolis in years. I just realized that, we but I want ravioli them. in the freezer. Not that kind. Chef Boyardee, excuse you, the good stuff. Oh. Yeah, so Mine I would want I I would as a hot. kid, <laughs> and then I, I and then recently, not recently, but the last time I had raviolis, I probably when I was living alone in my apartment in Cincinnati and and had lots of time to myself, <laughs> I would I would like I would see how many I could swallow whole. I got up to three big ones, but that really hurt. Like that really really hurt. Why would you? Do Are they hot? Yeah. Cold ravioli. No, but like hot. You only saw. Oh, not burning hot. hot. No, they're 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 eating temperatures. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Look at your minerals. Yes, it's water. the good stuff. Chef Boyardee is the good shit. I don't what, like all this fancy hoity-toity ravioli. I never had Chef Boyardee, but my my best friend did growing up. You've and... never had Chef Boyardee? No, I had, but I'd only have it oh. at my friend's house. Oh. Okay. They would make it, but I didn't have it. You need to chew them. You don't soup. need to chew them. That was a big part of my life. Like for a long phase of my life, did, I would swallow. What did your brother think about I would that? He, he didn't know about it. I, I don't know. You did it quietly? I, I probably told him. Yeah. Just, Watch me swallow these yeah. raviolis. I'd just, I'd just be like. <laughs> <laughs> like and he'd look over at me and be like, you all right? Fine. <laughs> 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 I'm that guy that like the hot dog video, like. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> 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 uh, anyway, so <laughs> Mark is a thought. <laughs> I'm just saying, can put down a whole can of ravioli. Oh, boy, are these gross like Skedios? How dare you! Oh, my dad had had a million dollar idea before this ever happened, like in the can form. Okay. My dad, you always when I was growing up, he would do a can of Spaghettios, okay. a can of ravioli. Heat them up together in a genius. pan pot. Th that's the thing. It was. It was genius. Did and he, he did that, that all the time. And then they made a can of spaghettios with ravioli. I mean, he could have made millions. Is it a million dollar idea? He could have made millions. Like he, it's not like he owned the rights to ravioli. He could have made millions. <laughs> I'm just saying. He was ahead of his time. Oh no, I'm not disagreeing. In the, in the Chef Boyardee <laughs> world. But they're different, they're different companies. So there was like a short time oh. collab. I feel like that didn't happen. I don't, did. I don't believe. It, what? What do you mean not believe? Spaghettios make me gag because I puked. <laughs> Spaghettios and ravioli. I don't. I'm looking at this up. You harking down ravioli is <laughs> like embedded in my brain. Oh, raviolios. <laughs> oh, that's different. <laughs> I don't think this is real. It was. Do you think I your dad just did that and was like, I made. You know what I mean? I think maybe he... No, because I had a dream as a child that my parents invented, you know, the wagon that has the little door and like the little seats so you could like put storage under, the little like yeah. green wagons. Yeah, yeah. I had a dream one day or night that uh, my parents invented those. Didn't happen. <laughs> and then like my weird brain for like a year straight was like, that was my parents. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> they did not invent that wagon. <laughs> but I, as a child, I was convinced. I was uh, very course. little. <laughs> anyway, so what was my point of all this? Why did this come up? Oh yeah, I can swallow a lot 
hole. <laughs> for ravioli specifically. Specifically ravioli. I'll, I'll, I'd rather eat the quarter, but everyone seems to be about the chapstick. Yeah, chapstick for sure. All right. Always speak in Pig Latin or always speak in Shakespeare dialogue? Shakespeare. Yeah, I guess I gotta pick Shakespeare. I'm assuming that means you only can pick quotes from Shakespeare. I just thought it was like, that's kind of like, well, yeah, because people didn't talk like how Shakespeare wrote. Mm -hmm. People didn't speak the way that plays were written and performed. Pig Latin would just get annoying. I mean, Shakespeare would get annoying too, but at least you could carry a conversation. It's, it's, yeah. Yeah, Old English is like, that's not how people actually talk. No, 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 no. Okay. Bring people back from the edge of death, but each time takes a year off your life. Or be able to grant wishes, but each time you forget a beautiful, meaningful memory from your past. I, there's a lot of words. Bring people back for, from the brink of death, or oh. be able to grant wishes, but lose. Or what's lose, the downside to the first one? Lose a year of your life. Oh. oh. Hmm. I prefer the eating chapstick questions. <laughs> Those are more fun. Like, yeah. is, there was a wasn't there a way to get like a only stupid questions? Yeah, I want only stupid way. questions. All right, let's well, let's skip these. Not nah, stupid. In a form where let other people create many more memories. Stupid. Hmm. Stupid. Yeah. No. Okay, I got it. Would you rather kill a unicorn in front of thousands of children or kill a beloved dolphin in front of thousands of children? <laughs> are you, but if, are you, does that mean that unicorns are real, or there's only one real I'm, unicorn, I'm assuming, and then you kill it? I'm assuming this is the only unicorn in it. Oh, you gotta kill the dolphin. There but, are other dolphins. But if you drink the unicorn's blood, it can cure any ailment, but, but you'll be cursed forever. But I don't need that. The dolphin, no, kill, dolphin. Dolphin's just a dolphin. <laughs> What's the dolphin got in its blood? Fish. <laughs> Fish aids. <laughs> I don't know. Something like that. I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, kill the dolphin. Everyone, everyone's screaming, kill the dolphin! <laughs> kill the dolphin. But you could be the guy that killed the unicorn. Yeah, dolphins are smarter, I would assume. Also, I mean, I, I'm going to assume a unicorn has the intelligence of a horse. Yeah. Also, I imagine it's going to be a bit harder to kill a unicorn than it would be to kill a I, dolphin. I don't think either of them are easy kills. You, you have to kill them with your bare hands. <laughs> I don't think I could kill Strangling either. Strangling a dolphin. I don't think Arr, I could. Stop breathing through your hole. Arr. Plug up the hole. <laughs> Someone get over here! Block up the hole! <laughs> this little Dutch boy comes over. A little Dutch boy! <laughs> he comes over and sticks his finger in the hole. Like the dam. Oh, I get it. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, you gotta kill the unicorn. Or not the unicorn, you gotta kill the dolphin. Gotta kill the unicorn, you heard it from no! Amy. Gotta kill the unicorn. 66% said they'd rather kill the unicorn. Why? It's special. I mean, I do. If you're gonna kill an animal in front of a bunch of shit, I want them to remember that. <laughs> All right, would you rather be a cat or be a dog? I feel like dogs get bored easier than cats. Chica, what do you think about this? <laughs> you were What's good. You hung out with Marzipan and you were good the whole time. Yeah. What are your thoughts? You guys hung out together. No thoughts? I also watched a video today um, where Jenna Marbles uh, introduces her dogs to a cat for the first time. Everyone, Very funny. Everyone in chat seems to be going cat. for cat. Cats just like sleep and they don't need. They don't. They don't need like. Dog. No. To be super social and active. It's a. It's a common misconception that cats get more sleep than dogs. Dogs actually get. Just Chica about sleeps sleep. all the time. Yeah. Chica Dog. Is, dogs and Chica's cats. She's not sleep. running. She's sleeping. She's like both are like eighteen hour a day sleepers. Yeah. Yeah. So like it's it's pretty much the same. I think I'd go cat though. Mm -hmm. Cats like look so calm. You have more independence as a cat. You have the capability of being a hunter, I guess. People and like yeah, you you can take care you can take care of yourself as a cat more than you can take care of yourself as a dog. Yeah. Dogs need people more than cats need people. I suppose that's true. Yeah, I think I'd go. I think I'd still go doggo. Doggo beacon. I'll be doggo. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Aww, she goes good to you. Good girl, come on, pop up. Oh, 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 good girl. Good Can people girl. see you? There you are. Her tail is a you. wagon. Oh, that's a good girl. That's a good girl. He's pretty good. That's a good girl. I'd be like you. Oh, friend. Like what you. kind of, what breed would you be? I'm uh, probably like a dachshund. Nice and short. <laughs> Not much. Not, not like a Doberman or something. I guess a great I, Doberman. There was a great day in at the dog park today. 
Oh my god. This dog was probably three times, at least three times the size of Chica. I've yeah. never, I mean, like, Great Danes are huge, but this dog was huge. And huge. you could barely sniff his butt, he was so big. Yeah. But you guys got along. You were a little scared. It was so funny because he wanted to run, and all the other dogs were running together, and as soon as he would try to run with them, they'd all be like, oh. <laughs> they'd all like disperse because they were all afraid of him. It was kind of, oh. it'd be hard to be a dog and no other dogs want to play with you because you're so big. Yeah. I guess it. Uh, maybe the Doberman, I guess. I don't know. Doberman are pretty cool. Hi, Baker. Eh, whatever. What do you think, puppy? All right, I'd choose be a dog. 63% said be a dog. Okay. Okay. Okay, would you rather not be able to feel any pain or have extremely brittle bones? <laughs> That's not funny, but it's kind of funny. <laughs> Not be able to wait. What? Not be able to feel any pain, which seems like a good thing. Uh, I mean, it would. I mean, that would. Yeah, you could. You. I mean, that's like people who don't have. That's like a thing. That is a thing. Very yeah. rare thing, but. Because then people like accidentally burn themselves and stuff. But like overall, why would you? What, what is this question? Hold on. <laughs> What's the benefit of having extremely brittle bones? <laughs> every every morning I break my legs. Well, <laughs> every morning I break my arms. Every night I break my legs. <laughs> I just I cry myself in bed until the heart attacks put me to sleep. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, no pain, I guess. Yeah, no pain sounds dangerous, but not as but dangerous also, as having brittle bones. bones. Yeah. <laughs> gotta drink your milk. Oh, damn. I'll take the pain. Yeah, only seven percent said brittle bones. Brittle bones! <laughs> uh bleh. boring. Would you rather always be naked and always, or always be itchy? Ooh. If you're always naked, aren't you? You're gonna get a little itchy. <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh, but you couldn't go outside. How itchy? You could go. How outside. itchy? Yeah, how itchy? Like I'm, a, like, I'm itchy like, I'm itchy most, a lot. I could constantly be itching myself. <laughs> yeah. Like, that's a thing. Naked. <laughs> everyone's, everyone's going but for naked. But you couldn't go outside. You could. Once. Feel like then people would have a problem. You'd have to like uh, go somewhere where you can do that. I don't know. Hmm. Itchy. I think I'd go itchy. I'll you be, go itchy. I'll go. I'll be itchy. You'll go for itchy. I'll be itchy. Yeah, I guess. How itchy? Yeah, you have to live in a nudist <laughs> colony. Yeah. Live at a nude beach. Live at the beach. I don't think you could live at a beach. <laughs> I guess, yeah, itchy, I guess. I Just know. for the sake of being able to live. in live. Florida, itchy's kind of a natural state of being. <laughs> <laughs> uh, would you rather hate your parents but have to be with them 24-7 or love your parents but have them both die a horrible, gory death right in front of you? I think I'd rather hate them just so they don't die a horrible, gory death in, in general. <laughs> but they have to be with them 24-7. I'm assuming that means like they're sleeping in the same bed as you and you fucking hate them. 24 7. 24 oh, what 7. What is. Oh. Oh, God. I still want to hate him. And you're 15 years old. It specifies you're 15 years old. Why? <laughs> okay. Wow. They're in the shower with you, they're on the toilet with you, just nagging you, like telling you to do better at pooping, and they're just but like, yeah, get. Get that poop. Or I love them and they die horribly. Yeah. Uh-huh. What would you pick? It's a toughie. Um. <laughs> it, it is a toughie. I mean, if if I hate them, they're probably gonna they're probably gonna die of natural causes. No, spiteful people last forever. Yeah. That's a natural state of the universe. Love your parents, but have them die a horrible, gory death right in front of you. Hate your parents, then kill them. Perfect. Then you're. Then you're I don't know. Hate. I'll go hate. I don't know. I mean, if you hate your parents, then you've probably got a shitty upbringing, and you're not going to turn out a good person. But if you have loving parents, and they die tragically. And you have to watch them die horribly. I don't know. I don't know. These are stressful. I don't, I don't like know. I think game. I'd still, even so, I think I'd still rather love my parents. Because for me, like, my dad died when I was 18. And it was like I, I had to watch him die. Yeah. It wasn't pretty. 
Um, but it's like that that made me right. a better person and stronger for it. If you hate your parents, then it's one of those situations where it's like... It's just hard to pick the option where someone dies. Yeah, it is. <laughs> no, it is. It is. Like, that's really where the struggle is. And in the, I don't think in this situation they're dying because of you. It's like you're choosing right. a life to live. Okay, yeah, that's that's a one point. Yeah. That's you're, you're not okay, making Okay, if you're taking that die. angle, yeah. then, like, yeah, maybe I would Because I that. think that's why it's specifying you're 15 years old. Like, this is just the way of your life. Right. And I think I would still rather have loving parents that loved me for 15 good years. Raised so your me very childhood well. is is good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And your parents died, yeah. and that would fuck you up, obviously. Yeah. And how you come out of that is like completely up to how you react. But even so, I think yeah, I'd go okay. with that one. Yeah. I think I personally. You didn't say slow, painful, true. Ooh, only 33 percent said <laughs> that. Yeah. Yeah, but you can't have bad parents and still turn out good. Oh yeah, no, absolutely. It's no twenty four seven. You are glued to the hip. Twenty four seven. They are with you, always criticizing, just nag, mm. nag, nag, nag. Anyway, <laughs> uh, that's a I question. skip. You can't skip. I'm skipping. One was a Would you rather watch Big Bang Theory or The Office? No, that's no, no. Someone even... is saying that I think they oh, skipped yeah. the question. Yeah, you can't skip. <laughs> Would you rather always run or always crawl? Always run. You get in real good shape if you're always running. I always want that. Like, as I think about this sometimes. Like, if you're walking around a big city, no one is running. But that is such a useful way to travel. Like, why is it not socially acceptable to run places? I don't know. Like at the mall. What if I want to? What if I want to run? I don't know. You could. I mean, you can. No, I know you can. But like, why is that not the way as like we've developed? I don't know because people only run when something's wrong. I think like that's a social conditioning thing. Right. If someone's running, everyone's like, "What's going on?" What, what, I just think that's happening? so weird that that is the way that it is. Yeah, but if you're crawling, everyone you're thinks you're equally through as the weird. Mall. <laughs> yeah, that's that's also weird. People yeah. are just like. Something, something yeah wrong. slow jog or are you sprinting i think i'd like to think it's a good run like yeah. it's it's more than a jog but it's not a full out running sprint. could cause a panic you just gotta smile while you're running oh no wait the, the specification is you would be sprinting so sprinting i couldn't you couldn't sprint. I'd sprint as far as i could you can't go you just okay so if you're exhausted from sprinting do you have to stop until you recover and i think so sprint yeah. more? i think so <sighs> If you were crawling, that'd fuck up your knees. If crawling would hurt your knees. I'd go run. Yeah, I think Eighty-nine percent said run. Yeah. Okay. Would you rather be emo or goth? Didn't you have a phase? I had a little bit of an emo phase. Yeah. A little bit. Everyone thinks that picture. I wanted to have an emo phase, but I didn't really. Everyone thinks there's a picture of me. Oh, that, uh, that's like what's. That's uh, uh, Ray Honda. Yeah. Yeah, not me, very specifically. But everyone's like, oh, the same. You had Nemo phase. I'm like, I was, it's not you. I was nerd 100%. I had no phases. I had no nothing. It's just goddamn. No, I had nerd. a wannabe emo phase, which is way more pathetic than an actual emo phase. Yeah. I think I picked God. So God's emo, it, just to specify, emo is like. Nah, life is sadness and. Emo is like a teenager me. thing, whereas like goth, I feel like, is not. Well, emo it was like thing. it came up because people emo were was like a trend emotional, became. like emo panic, was a panic at the distance. Right, emo was a trend, and like goth is less of a trend. Goth is goth more has been around, and it's still yeah, around. Goth is like I don't think emo rah. really exists. Goth in the same is more band. out of anger, I would say. Not like Victorian goth. Like, oh yeah, yeah okay. no, no. I don't. Okay, I don't know enough about like goth culture to. I, I don't know either. Yeah, I, I don't goth. Yeah. I'll be emo. <laughs> yeah, God, you could be a vampire if you're Oh, gone. wait. No, I'm going back to one. Would you rather discover the Loch Ness Monster or discover Sasquatch? Now, you have to think of how you're discovering these things. I like Nessie. I'm now, big into Nessie. Now, that would scare me because if I was discovering Nessie, uh, I imagine I'm in a boat. No, I'm thinking you're on a dock the and then she just pokes her big head up and she's like... Hello. No, I imagine like, you, you, know, you know the snake from God of War. It's like that oh. head comes out of the ocean yes. is just angry. Yeah, you just confirmed it. Now, Absolutely. Now discovering Sasquatch You'd be in the woods. would still be just as scary. Still yeah. be just as scary. 
You know, I have a theory. Yeah, you have a good theory. I have a theory about uh, Sasquatch. I'm sure I'm not this. the first one to, to ever think of this. I'm sure I'm not. But Sasquatch, Bigfoot, like the Yeti, mm-hmm. like the the abominable snowman. A like, large hairy creature. Large hairy creature exists in a bunch of time, temperate, or, or a bunch of climates. Yeah. I think what must have happened at some point is there's an, there was an offshoot of humanity. Like, before before humanity. Go back to, like, Common Ancestor, whatever that was. Like, as that developed, it wasn't just a straight line to humanity. It couldn't have been. There were a bunch of offshoots, a bunch of different, like, evolutionary, like, like types, things like that. And what happened was, was like, we, like, they, they have evidence that humans and Neanderthals coincided. Like, mm-hmm. they coexisted at the same time, and they competed. And they also cohabitated. They competed mm-hmm. and, like, worked together because they were very close and, like, of similar intelligence. Mm-hmm. My thought is, like, Sasquatch, the Yeti, all this comes from an offshoot of humanity that was big, hairy, a bit more ape-like than us, yeah. more about, like, strength, still intelligent, yeah. like, and stuff like that. And we were talking about this because we were talking about the, uh, the, 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 what, the, what's uh, it the called? Past, the past. Uh... <laughs> The, the Russian past where those campers, like, died so mysteriously. Like, just, like, no one knows how they died, why they died. The, the ones where they ripped their tongues out, probably. Yeah, like, where the tongue got ripped out of that lady. and then, the uh, D? Dilatov. The Dilatov. Dilatov. I the did Dilatov. look it up. I knew that. The Dilatov. And they were talking the about, like, pass. they were talking, and they skated over the whole, like, abominable snowman. But I'm like, what if? What if there's still some, like, remnants of this lineage of an offshoot of humanity, like a cousin, uh, like third cousin of humanity that coexisted at the same time as like the Neanderthals and stuff like that. And it, it still existed until recent times. Like it existed until recent mm-hmm. times, but we we hunted them out like recently. Yes. Stuff like that. And so the reason we have these stories about like the Sasquatch and the Abominable Snowman is because around. they might still be around. They might. Just a few pockets of them left. That know, that really know, being like, don't fuck with the humans. They're bad news bears all around, which I think is the basis of the movie Bigfoot that's coming out, the anime movie. The basis movie. of the movie Bad News Bears. <laughs> the basis Bad News Bears, Bigfoot. Also, to the person Bingo who said, Bongo. The people who said Dilatov's past was aliens, it was not his uh, tiny, tiny. Uh, tornadoes. That's the one. Tiny, tiny sound tornadoes. <laughs> it was tiny sound tornadoes. Which I would, I would it's be. It's the fascinated. most reasonable explanation. Which is so weird that that's the a most tiny reasonable. sound tornadoes. Is that's the, the most reasonable explanation. It doesn't explain the tongues. What kind it of does? Because they just go crazy. Yeah. No. Bite your tongue off. To 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 rip someone's tongue out or cut it out while they're still alive. They were still alive. Is so beyond just my ears. That's so beyond. Do That's you, so beyond. Is it ripped out, or did maybe someone like did they bite their own tongue off? No way. But they're they're, they're not a hundred percent sure that that happened. Oh yeah, that's also like it maybe it doesn't happen because there's so much like cover up. Yeah. But why is there so much cover or the, up? About why would the government cover it up if it was just? Tiny, and it's, tiny and it's hurricane, the Russian government that tornadoes. we're talking about. Why would the Russian government cut it up? Cover it up? Look, guys, <laughs> it was tiny sound tornadoes. Except that maybe it's not. Maybe it's not. Why would the government cover it up? Maybe it's Yetis. Maybe it's Nessie. Maybe it's Nessie. Maybe Nessie crawled up in there in the snow. My French kissing gone wrong. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, what were we talking about? Uh, uh, still a tough pass is fascinating. I do not want to discover the Loch Ness monster. Why? Just for personal, bro, 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 I, no I just feel like I don't want to be there. I feel like the when Loch Ness monster would be more friendly, and also you can run away because if it can only swim, and you can stay on land. My thought is if if. If Loch Ness Monster did exist and no one's discovered it until that point, because he, Loch Ness ate everyone else that discovered Loch Ness. I don't want to be that. I don't want to be that. There's a bug. Get out of here. Get out of here. Mm. So let's watch. Uh, people disagree with me. Come on. Whatever. All right. No. Okay, would you rather punch every trick-or-treater that knocks on your door in the face or answer the door for trick-or-treaters completely naked? What's the first one? Punch every trick-or-treater that knocks on your door in the face. Somehow that's better. Answer the door completely. Well, answering completely naked probably has a longer jail sentence than punching. That's the thing. That's what I'm thinking. But I've always said, I've always said, you know this about me. Everyone knows this about me. I would gladly punch a baby in the face. But a kid? 
Oh, easily. Babies don't trick or treat. I would gladly what punch. What if it's a parent carrying a baby in like a pumpkin Both costume? of them. I got two fists for a reason. Bam. I wonder if they're holding twins. Oh, man. I got a footy that can really get oh, up there. Footy. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna punch everybody. Like if it's over four, I'm in trouble. But if it's four or less, I've got four limbs for a reason. Punch. Punch. Could you like kill a child with a punch? Oh hell I yeah! Couldn't, I, I think. could easily kill a baby with one. Well, that's punch. what I'm saying. So if you're forced to like full force punch a kid to the point where you might kill them, maybe you should go for naked. Yeah, I'm a danger at that point. <laughs> Hmm. I, I would like to specify, I would gladly punch a baby for the right reason. If there was a good reason. If it's a shitty baby. Yeah. <laughs> this baby has pooped itself too much. <laughs> Mark, you know what to do. <laughs> boss baby. Did you punch the boss baby? <laughs> no answer. Yeah. I don't think I could punch the boss baby. <laughs> boss baby's too strong. Yeah. I wouldn't punch a baby. Maybe. You might punch. I uh, might. You might. I probably would. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Every, everyone could easily kill a baby with a uh, punch. A child, not a baby. Trick or treater. Oh, a child. Oh. I'm just saying, if if you're forced to go like full force, to, and you think you're strong enough to hit a baby, you know what I mean? If I really. I don't know. Maybe. Depends on the I kid, I right? have no idea how... Wait, is the question, could I kill a kid with one punch? Yes. Because in that case, you should do naked. Right? You should go naked if, you, if there's a risk of you actually killing the kid. Well, it doesn't say I have to punch full force. That's what I'm wondering. If it's not full force, then maybe punch. Which one I can mean, you no, make up? I... No, 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 but you could play stupid if you open the door naked, maybe. No, I... I would rather punch the kids because with the naked thing, that's just... Well, actually, is it? No, it would be. It, there's no way. Once once would be a mistake. For everyone, yeah, yeah, you're obviously you up to something. You might be able to be like, oops, I forgot. Oh, I know the solution. Just get a doorbell. Don't People would still knock. Please ring the doorbell. Big arrow. And then someone would knock and be like, I warned you! And you have an excuse to punch them! <laughs> like, please ring the doorbell. I will have to punch you if you If knock. you don't. Hmm. Leave candy outside. People still knock if you leave candy outside. That just happens. That's just a thing Keep that all happens. the lights. Uh, no one trick-or-treats around here. No. To be fair, you have to like put your name on a list to have trick or treaters here. I'll punch them. I'm gonna. I volunteer to punch them. <laughs> anyway, um, boo. Yeah, just don't be home on Halloween. Remove all your doors. <laughs> Would you rather eat a rotten raw steak or a cooked human liver? Are there maggots? I'm assuming they're probably maggots. I do human. Why not? You do human? Now, see, human. the thing is, I don't like liver. But how badly do you not like liver? I really don't like liver. It's a texture ever, thing. It's too mushy. Have I ever tried liver? Liver, oddly enough, tastes like cat food. I, I that's, I think, I think that in my mind, oh. that comparison. And yes, I ate cat food recently. You'll see about that. Um, <laughs> but I could power through a steak. Maggot steak. Extra protein. Uh, maggots really get to me. I don't know because if you eat the human liver, then you like. You have I to get a say, taste. You get a taste for it. <laughs> you're that's unstoppable. Just, after that's what that. happens. It just happens. Yeah. Would you go to jail? Does anyone need to know? The raw steak wouldn't kill you. Yeah, I wouldn't. Be, how big? I don't know. It might kill you. No. Yeah, you either get sick or you go crazy. <laughs> Too much disease risk. I mean, not really. I mean, you'd probably get sick, but you'd be surprised what the human body can digest. And I just want to know what happens if I ate a human liver. No, nothing would happen. You don't know that. <laughs> don't look at me like it, that. 
Don't don't look I'm at looking at your stop liver. Stop looking at my liver. <laughs> I'm looking at your stop liver. looking at my liver. Do you have to get the liver yourself? <laughs> I'm assuming it's delivered to you. <laughs> I think I'll go with the steak, honestly. Oh, nah. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the steak. It's pretty even split, 43 to 57. Okay. Yeah. Would you rather have two million YouTube subscribers or one million Twitter followers? Mark. I mean, would you rather? Which I one would a, you rather tank? <laughs> <laughs> do I have to get rid of one to get the other? Yeah. I, mean, I don't know. Like the, I mean, all that means you just have to purge one, right? This was it. My eyes are up here. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but your liver's down there. Yeah. Um. I mean, the YouTube subscribers has more money potential. Yeah. Like. Twitter what, what is Twitter? Yeah. What's Twitter? I mean, if you have two million YouTube subscribers, you're eventually gonna get. Twitter following anyway. Is it just like a cap on it? Because that could be like a cool thing where it's like, oh, I'm only allowed to have that many. So it's like exclusive. Yeah. Two million YouTube subscribers, you can make a living off that. You make good videos. Yeah. I mean, if you just have the subscribers and no, but, video, but and for you, you don't know how to make I think videos. for you, you'd rather choose Twitter because you don't want to lose all those YouTube subs. Because for you, it would imply then what? That you don't have 20 anymore. You only have two. Oh, I'd go down. Right? Uh, maybe. I guess. Subs don't mean anything anymore, though, on YouTube, so what does it matter? Yeah. Ha ha. Ha ha. Got, got him. Got him. Got him. Shout out to YouTube. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Stupid question. <laughs> Would you ever have a banana stuck in your ear or a banana stuck up your nose? How deep in the ear? Let's say. You can't, how far do you get? Let's say enough that the banana stays there by itself. How? How? Well, the nose, too. How's that going to be any better? Look, for me, easy peasy. <laughs> <laughs> Got enough nose. Got that thing right in there. I guess with your nose. ear, your ear, you lose, you, you risk losing your hair. Yeah. And I, I wouldn't want to risk that. You can't take it out ever. That's the thing. What? In what world? <laughs> Does it rot or do you have to replace it every time it starts to go bad? I... Oh, God. Both ears or just one ear? I guess it just stays there until it... This is impossible. Bananas I mean, are mushy. Okay. I, <laughs> yeah, I, wait, is it a whole banana or are you just shoving, like, mushy banana in? That's just, that doesn't specify. How, how don't, that changes things. I'd go with nose just because I've had, like, for, for surgeries, I've had the nose thing shoved down my nose before. It sucks and hurts, but your nose has big sinuses, and it's not like it's going to... Oh, not not subs mean nothing to you as in subs mean nothing. I I, I meant like like YouTube. I don't doesn't. give a no, gosh that's not darn what I meant. shitty titty about no, any I subscriber that, out there. Is that the sub box they work. are just numbers just to my joke, wallet. All they are are dollar I just look at my YouTube, my eyes go into dollar signs, just cha ching cha ching. I look at my stats, shares are a little low this month. I deserve more. Anyway. I want you to have a soundboard, but it's you five years ago saying shares are a little low. <laughs> I just do that, yeah. Just like that'll be my that'll be my like subscriber sound effect. Like shares are a little low. I can do that right now. Hang on. You gotta find that. I don't know where it's Okay, place. someone please help me out here. Pull the sound clip from me saying shares are a little low this month. Or here, I'll just say it right now. No, it's gotta be the old one. Okay, alright. Someone in the pull voice? someone pull I can't ha old okay, old Mark Blair. Shares are a little low this month. Mm, no, you sound like Kermit. That's not good. Uh, I don't know about this. Hello, everybody. Markiplier here with a brand new Let's Play of Amnesia The Dark Descent. Shares are a uh, little low this month. I think I think the exact thing was, shares are a little low this month. Mm. <laughs> I hate that. Oh. <laughs> Someone, someone oh, go pull this, that sound clip from the video. I forget what the video is, but someone go pull that. Was uh, it from the sound... live stream? Thing? No, it was okay. from an update vlog where I talk about my YouTube stats. Because I did that. <laughs> I didn't know what to do oh, back then. God. I didn't know. I I wanted people to be involved with my day to day. No, no, I know it was well intended. It was just like, I want you to know because I could go. You want me to go over my stats? I'll do it again. I'm going to go over my, I'm gonna go over my YouTube 
We'll look at my stats. No, no one's asking. You're I'm just, looking you, you at my stats. No one is asking for it. I'm You're doing just doing this, this. because you want to. I'm, uh, yes. God, I hate that. Like, the when I go to my YouTube channel, it auto plays. It didn't used to do that, then they changed it. It's like, fuck it. Auto, yeah, everyone does that. Yeah, I don't know why. Well, it does um, for other people, but it used to be like, if I'm going uh, to my own channel, own. it doesn't fucking do yeah, that. Yeah, that would make sense. Yeah, but it, I feel like they could, if you just told them, that was annoying. I try to tell them so much shit. YouTube does not listen. I feel like you had a conversation about that with All right, we're going to analytics. Okay, Let's guys. do this. Buckle up. All right. So, in the past month, now consider I was on exile, so it's a little lower than <laughs> usual. I'm not gonna like, I'm not gonna get on you about the shares, because obviously, you know, I was in exile. Watch time: one billion eighty-five minutes, five hundred. How many lifetimes? How many lifetimes is that? Do the math. Uh. How many human lives? Okay, that is okay how many let me see how do i people do, are leaving how do i do cumulative <laughs> how many how do i do cumulative uh monthly here we go okay so uh last month i had last in may in all of may 826 million uh minutes watched which is 1571 years total What's the average? What's the average lifespan? Include we gotta count sleeping as well. Yeah, like seventy years or so. Okay, but if you sleep for a third of your life, then let's say forty-five years. I guess, yeah. Forty-five years. How many years? What divided? One thousand five hundred and seventy-one. That's thirty-five people. Yeah. That's that, thirty-five. That's people. on a low month. When I was, 35. I uploaded. Like, People uh, uh, born and died only watching your videos. Average view duration eight minutes and twenty seconds. That's oh, pretty good. No. Views one hundred and thirty million. Oh, no. uh, likes two million nine hundred and forty one thousand. Oh, dislikes. Why are you reading? Oh no. Dislikes forty nine thousand three hundred seventy four. Cut that shit out. <laughs> <laughs> Comments four hundred fifty five thousand. There's just a spike. Yeah. What? what did you Boom. ask the people to comment one day? I don't know. I don't know what happened that day. What happened on... Wait, what day is this? What day is There's that? a comment spike. What happened on the 17th of May? Someone go check. Wait, I'm gonna, I need to check. What happened on the 17th of May? What video would... What, what is happening then? Oh! Wait, does it count that? It says it's a live stream. Uh... Oh. I didn't think it counted that. That was those when I was comments? signing the it calendars. It considers those as comments? I guess. That wow. seems cheaty. Yeah, that's a little cheaty. That's stupid. Okay, that doesn't count. That doesn't count. Mm -hmm. Shares. 161,000. It's a little low, guys. <laughs> <laughs> there was a spike. There was a spike on shares at some point. I don't know. That might have been Baldi's Basics or something like that. Yeah. So, uh, gender. Male, 65%. Female, 35%. Fascinating. In case keep, you were curious. Keep going. Uh, top geographies. United States is 70% of my audience. United Kingdom coming in at 5.7. Canada with 4.4. Australia with 2.5%. Philippines, 1.7. Australia's a little low this month. Australia's a little low this month. Hmm. <laughs> just saying. Just saying. Shares are a little high this month. <laughs> <laughs> uh, traffic sources suggested What's videos. What's age? What, what, are your, what are your age? You could be selling this for good money, Mark. You're really, oh, you're really letting them have it for free here. Well, you know, I like to share with my fan base. Uh, it's about 14% of my views are from people aged 13 to 17 years. 42% of my views come from people 18 to 24 years old. That's crazy. Um, 26% is 25 to 34, 11% is 35 to 44, 5% is 45 to 54. Hell yeah. 1% is 55 to 64, 1.4% is 65 plus. Do you get people just scrolling all Looking the way at you guys. the age thing and then? Looking at you guys. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't, I don't know how accurate it is, but I've been told, I've asked YouTube this, yeah. I'm like, how accurate? Yeah. And they said it's like, pretty it's good. It's really accurate. Because <laughs> if there's one thing Google does, it's collect your data. That's uh, fascinating. Yeah. So yeah, that that always that always throws me off because 18 to 24, man. 18 to 24, 42 percent of my views. Mm -hmm. Is that you guys? Mm -hmm. That's you guys. That's you guys out there. That's me, guys. Yeah. Um. Other than that, I don't know. What else is there? 
<laughs> end screens, I guess. That's not. End screens. Uh, I always liked with the Vlogbrothers every year put out basically just like a big old poll and they put all these like interesting questions on it and then they publish all the, the stats that they get. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah. Anyway, so mm -hmm. someone pulled me that sound clip, like link it somewhere on Tumblr. I'll get it. I'll, I'll make it my sub, uh, my sub sound effect. It's just constantly going off. It's like ninjas. Yeah. All right. What else are we doing here? Oh yeah. What is the age limit on Twitch? Yeah, maybe don't say your age if you're little. Oopsies. Oh. I, I don't know what, what the, the age thing on Twitch is. Uh. You gotta say your something. Okay. All right. I think we've played this out. Oof. Oh yeah, under 18. Oops. Guys, guys, shh, shh, shh. Well, you have to be 18 to, to have, a, to have a Twitch account? I don't know. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Shh, shh. That We're all any... just saying numbers. Why would that make sense at all? I don't know. Why would it be under? Why would you have to be 18 to make? What is this like a porn site? Why do they have so many restrictions on feet then? If everyone's over 18 with an account, then what's but the this point? Isn't of a, this isn't a mature stream. I don't even know how to set that to that. I know honestly. Ethan's is a mature stream. I, honestly, I don't know how to set it. I don't. Know. It doesn't matter. It's probably what, what the fine. Fuck does it matter? Mr. Twitch is. Going through ban and all it's 13. Guys. It's 13. Yeah, that's what oh, I never thought. Never mind. Okay, yeah. so unless, if you're, it was 18 unless plus, you're a little bad, yeah, then you probably shouldn't be watching. We had, we had an idea that we were going to, um, I, or I was going to live stream myself normally just playing a game, but oh, I was yeah. going to do it on uh, my free cams, which is like a uh, uh, a cam girl site. So I was, I was just going to do it naturally, like just like be there, like hey guys. I mean, can't, I guess why not, right? Why? Why not? Why not? Yeah. Yeah, oh, I, think people could I do don't it. know how they're. <laughs> a site works. private let's play that people could like, like pay for and there's like, something hey, to yeah. that I think. How's it going? Hey, and if someone found you, they couldn't admit to it otherwise. Uh -huh. It's fun. Is it funny? It's when we talk about bad dragons before. <laughs> Who didn't know what bad dragon was? Is a it lot Bob? Of people, oh, Bob! Yeah, Bob yeah. didn't know, which blew give, my you mind. You guys can give him shit for that. Bob did not know what bad dragon was. <laughs> I think he knew. He just didn't want to admit. <laughs> but we all admitted it. I mean, I admit everything that I know. I, I know think so that's much weird. shit. That's just like an internet thing. Dude, I've seen so much shit on the internet. I have no shame about what I've seen, where I've been. Like, I've been pretty much everywhere on the internet. <laughs> anyway, I think we, uh, I think that's good Anyways, enough for now. on that note. Well, in that, in the settings on Twitch, the channel video tabs has the mature. Why is it in the video tabs? I'm not going to change it. Fuck that <laughs> shit. All right. Anyway, we outie. Thanks right. for joining us on this uh, different stream. Some good conversations come out of this. Who, who should we raid? Oh, Guys, don't go anywhere yet. You, I don't. You stick, no one I watch is on right now. You stick right here with me. I don't think. Let me refresh. No, TJ Ryan streaming. I don't have everyone's Boogie. offline. Boogie streaming. Gassy. Mm -hmm. Recommended you. Anyone know anyone streaming? Mm. No one. Just go to bed, everybody. Go to bed. Yeah. Ninja. Yeah, he needs it. <laughs> uh, I, I think we'll just we'll just okay. call it a night. All right, guys, get some sleep. All right, you guys have a good night, everybody. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. You uh, stay pretty out there. And uh, is, that, some, <laughs> is that your new outro? Yeah, I think it's. I think, you think it works? Stay pretty out there. I like that. Stay pretty out there. How do you look? Oh, you don't have a light. Okay, see, I'm like, how are you making eye contact with your camera? But I have a ring light on mine. So I can't look you guys in the eye because <laughs> it hurts. There's just spots in my vision now. Okay, bye. Okay, bye.